City Council. Generally, the City Council will not take official action on the items discussed at this time. We may place the item on file. Take the matter under advisement. Refer the matter to staff or committee for a future report or direct the matter to be placed on an upcoming agenda. Anyone wish to speak? Robin Hessel, 807 First Street, Southeast. Let there be no doubt that the words I'm about to say are intended to demand adherence to the very laws this body has enacted. When government at any level is allowed to break its own laws, we have reached the level of tyranny just for the sake of tyranny. I object to a lawless government, especially when the laws being broken involve public funds or taxpayer dollars as is the case with the publicly funded golf course advisory board. Perhaps Julian Assange recently said it best, quote, it's part of the calculation of power to project power. And one of the ways to project power is to show that you are unaccountable. So don't try to touch us. Your own mission statement reads in part, the mission of the City of Little Falls is to provide a safe, positive environment for, through the responsive, efficient, and cost-effective delivery of city services while celebrating and building upon our treasured history. This statement is adopted with the following core beliefs. Excellence and quality in the delivery of municipal services, fiscal responsibility with ethics, and integrity. Yet, the counselor, Lauren Boyum, whose idea this mission statement was, is the very person who suggested allowing the Golf Advisory Board Ordinance Number 229 another two months free pass at breaking the law. You do not meet the mark of this mission statement. You fall short of honest leadership and good example. What kind of treasured history are you leaving behind? Under Section 2.05 of the City Charter, the Mayor shall study the operations of the City Government, neglect dereliction of duty or waste that may come to the mayor's attention on the part of any officer or department of the city. You, Mr. Mayor, fail to honor or fulfill section 2.05. Your own charter chapter one, conduct which is prohibited by ordinance and or which the actor may be sentenced to imprisonment, fine or both, the term violate includes failure to comply with 103 reads, violation of misdemeanor or petty misdemeanor. Every person violates a chapter, section, subsection, paragraph, or provision of this city code when he performs an act thereby prohibited or declared unlawful and upon conviction thereof shall be punished as for a misdemeanor or for a petty misdemeanor. Who wouldn't be ashamed of your hypocrisy? Martin Luther King said, our lives begin to end the day we become silent about things that matter. You're not above the law, are you? Anyone else wish to speak? Is this a good time to talk about the Gall property rezoning?